magnetic field due to a solenoid. Objective To calculate magnetic field inside a current carrying solenoid. A solenoid is a tightly wound helical conducting coil whose diameter is very small compared to its length. The winding of each turn of the solenoid is sufficiently taut for it to be approximated to a circular wire loop lying in the plane perpendicular to the axis of the solenoid. When current passes through the solenoid, the magnetic field generated by each of its loops gets added. For symmetry, it can be inferred that the magnetic field generated at the core of a constant current carrying solenoid is uniform and is directed along the axis of the solenoid. Outside the solenoid, the magnetic field is very weak. Let us calculate the magnetic field due to a current carrying solenoid having n turns per unit length. Consider an Amperian rectangular loop ABCD near the axis of the solenoid. Line AB is parallel to the axis and is therefore parallel to the magnetic field B inside the solenoid. Thus, integral B dot DL from A to B is equal to BL. CD is outside the solenoid, hence B dot DL is 0. BC and DA are perpendicular to the magnetic field, so their contribution to the line integral is nil. Hence, integral B dot DL around ABCD is B into L. As N is the number of turns per unit length along the axis of the solenoid, number of turns covered by the rectangle is NL. Total current passing through the area of the rectangle is number of turns multiplied by the current in each turn, that is, NL into I. From Ampere's law, Line integral of B dot DL in the loop ABCD must be equal to mu naught NLI. On solving for B, we get B is equal to mu naught NI. Summary Magnetic field inside a solenoid that has n turns per unit length and through which current I passes is given by B is equal to mu naught ni